Hi everyone, today we are going to learn how to draw giraffes. So on this drawing, there are four giraffes. The father, mother, sister, and a brother. Uh, we try to make it cute because this drawing is normally for age five to seven years old kids. So you can choose how many giraffes you want as you wish, around three to four. So first we need a piece of paper and we put the paper vertical way and try to find the first one. You can make on the left or on the right or in the middle. So now I draw a straight line on the left part. This length of the line is the height of the giraffes and the length of the neck. And the second, we're going to draw the second line. This line might be shorter than the first one because we're going to add the head between them. So the space between the two lines is a width of the neck. And then we use a curvy line, draw the hat. And when we finish the first draft, we're going to do the second one. Uh, again, we're going to do a straight line first, but this one, we're going to change the different height. So we made the shorter height than the first one. And then the same way, we do the second line, shorter than the first line, and do the hat. So you can move the hat to, towards the left or towards the right. And we finish the two small one on in the middle part. So that's a family, the base shape. And then we're going to start draw the ears and the horn on the head. So the ear, two ears, separate and leave some space for the two horns. The two horns looks like a lollipop. It's a circle and with two straight lines. And when we finish the, all of the parts, we start drawing the mouth and the nose and the eyes. So we use a curve to show where's the mouth with the nose. And we start to the eyes. The eyes, you can make difference. Some eyes look downward, some eyes look forward, upward, and you can make some uh, different style. And we use Sharpie to tr just trace the mouth, the nose, the eyes, and leave the rest just as is. Because we're going to use a pen to color it. So now we choose the similar um, giraffe color. And uh, here I choose the yellow color. So I color the, e the ears, horns, the neck, the face. And use a tiny brush to the hair behind the neck. So we do from the from the neck to the outside and make the same way, leave some space between them. When finished, we're going to use some brown to the spots on the neck. You can make some spots bigger, some spots smaller, make it some looks free. And then we do the background. We use pencil to draw some different type of leaves because the giraffe is tall. So they normally they eat some leaves in the in the high in the high space, so we draw some leaves on the top part, and use paint or other color, uh, color the green for the leaves, and the last one we need the we need the other space to the coloring. So now uh, here I chose the light blue for the sky and add some um, grass and flowers in the bottom part, but you can choose any color you like, make look looks nicer. Um, that's it. Uh, today's class. I hope you like it. Uh, you can try. Thanks.